game one of this playoff showdown. Let's put the hype aside and find out who's the better team. Opening face-off is just seconds away. for him and when it doesn't drop it can be extremely frustrating you want to get points you want to feel like you're contributing indy's got the win off that draw and he slides it quickly to martin toledo's got a hold of the puck now moves it around along the half wall weeks makes an excellent save on an incredible scoring chance for the puck along the boards. Indy's got it in their own zone. Along the half wall with the puck. Quick feed to Prepovesis. Gaining momentum along the boards. Fires it on net. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Weeks. the draw inside the offensive zone. Cairns takes the puck. Indy's on the attack. And he takes a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. They're going to keep things moving here. Who's the puck? Toledo's in on the offensive attack now. The fuel have gained possession off the wall. Grabs it in his own end. Quick pass to Cameron. Indy's got the puck in the defensive end. Looking for space inside the D zone. Here's a short pass to Cairns. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Trying to pick his spot, and that goes off the side of the net. Slides the puck across to McGrath. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. Heads deep inside the offensive zone. Strong defensive effort. Still lots of time left here in this frame. Still scoreless in this one. Indy's won the defensive zone draw. Bulmer scooped up the puck now here inside his own zone. Down the right wing and into the offensive zone. Oh, and he somehow got a little piece of it, and it stays out of the net. Gagne's determination on the puck, even though he stumbled and has a lack of balance, really shows right there, James, as he finds a way to get that pass through to the shooter. From the left side, they gain the zone. Takes a shot, and that was stopped. Moves it to Sachuk. Can't hang on to the puck after the break. Denies him in close. Misses wide. He gets a great look at the net, but it is way off target. It can be fast, it can be hard, but it's got to hit the net. Toledo's looking to break out of their own end. And he takes the feed. Oh, excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. Indy's in now. Fires it! Big time saving goal as he gets all of it with the stick. Oh, he stopped it! What a save on the play! And there's nothing technical about that. That is all about the will to find a way to make that save incredible, James. Such an impressive save. 
big, James. And I love to look at these ones again because it's not just being in great position. It's being desperate. It's finding a way to get to the puck, keeping your eye on it at all times, tracking it, out battling and out drilling everyone around you. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Toledo's got him in their own zone. Quick shot. Turned aside with the glove by Weeks. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. We're still scoreless. Toledo's won the faceoff. Hammers a shot wide of the net. He missed. Well, you recognize that it's a game of inches, James, and this is on full display right here. This is a great shot. Doesn't miss by much, but it's a miss all the same. Oh, and he takes possession of the puck from off the wing with the centers all locked up there off the draw. Indy's got the puck along the wall. Turned aside with the glove by Bednar. Indy's got it in the offensive zone. And it fakes off a stick in traffic. Oh, great save right there on the play. Let's it go. The nose of McCann. Insides digging in for that puck along the wall. Intercepts the pass. My goodness, look at this. The pressure is really starting to cook. Past the halfway mark of this period. Still looking for our first goal. And they win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Hammers a shot! Bittner's opted to hang on to the puck for a faceoff. Martin's known to bring the offense for his team. Bedner's the star goaltender who backstops his team confidently. I'm expecting one of these players to make a big difference for their team before the game is over. Back to you guys. Good heads-up defensive play as he extends the stick. Devastating hit into the boards and listen to this building rattle. Toledo's got a hold of the puck. Suit, Cheryl. And I'm right there with you, James. I wouldn't want to be along those boards either. It almost looked like he left his feet early, but nonetheless, it's a bone crusher. Centers get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. And they win the defensive zone faceoff. Toledo's got it along the wall. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Oh, look at the glove saved by Pednar. has won the draw. Takes a shot. Oh, read it perfectly. What a save. He's got it behind the cage. Toledo's looking to break out. Working the puck deep inside their own end. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Moves the puck into the attacking area. And he takes the feed. Pokes it away in his own end. Indy's got it in their own zone. With possession along the wall. Puts it on there. Oh, denies him with the paddle save. Levels him with the hit. Toledo's got the puck in the defensive end. Cuts to the point. What a great read breaking up the pass. Cairns works the puck in his own zone. The Walleye have possession along the boards. Puck not loose in neutral zone. The Fuel have taken possession in their own end. And that'll free up the puck. And they send it right back to him. Moves it quickly over to Lang. Oh, he 
couldn't put it past. What a stop by Bednar. What an incredible save in the high danger scoring area. I mean, right in the slot, he's in perfect position to make that club save. Here in the late going of the frame, we've still got zeros on the board. Taken by Anderson. Toledo's got it in their own zone. Excellent stick work on the play. Here they come on the attack down the left side. Cutting to the slot. Stones him in front. We'll get a face off after the puck stays covered up. Officials ready to drop the puck and get things back underway. Lumos wins the offensive zone face off, and here we go. Here's a chance. What a block as he lays out, and I'm sure he'll feel that one. All quick work with the stick and comes up with the puck. Puck picked up by Santazzo. Toledo's gonna play it from the corner. Slides it back to the blue line. Deflected away, nice defensive use of the stick there. Moves the puck along the half wall. Grabbed along the board by Martin. Here's a chance! Oh, save on the play, wow! Oh, that's grand larceny, James. I mean, he just stole one away from his opponent. What a save. There it is, James, the first goal of this playoff series, and everyone wanted that one. You want to play with the lead, and you certainly want to dictate it. Indy's taking the one nothing lead here late in this first period. Well, anytime a goal is scored, James, it's a momentum builder for their team. And, and you know what? At the end of a period, it creates even more energy. You got the body language, you got the energy hitting the dressing room, and you get set to start the second. Now you got all that positive pent-up energy, and you look to start the second the same way you ended the first. Here's a chance! That's love by Weeks. There's the whistle as the goalie hangs on. Lemus, he's having a lot of fun out there. Why wouldn't he be James? I mean, he's putting up numbers left, right, and center on this point streak. But you know who's also having a lot of fun? His team, they're rallying around him, looking forward to another one. Reaches, trying to shake loose. Denies him on the breakaway. And he cuts up big again. Ah, beauty save back there. He's really owning his crease. And nearing the final 60 seconds of this opening stanza. Toledo's got the puck. Up along the wing. Here's an odd man rush. A little bump and grind, but still hangs on to the puck. Here's a shot. Scores! At the buzzer, and they got one. Well, coaches always say the first minute and the last minute of every period are critical. Well, now they've got momentum heading into the next frame. they got to carry it forward. Well, good things happen when you put the puck to the net and this rebound comes right back out to him. But he's tracking, he's sniffing, he's hounding, and he finds the back of the net on the second shot. Some last-second communication before both teams get ready to drop the puck here. Toledo's won the faceoff at center. Indy's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Sends a pass over. Takes the shot! There's the buzzer. Fans seem to enjoy that first 20 minutes. We'll get to the second period right after both teams get a chance to catch their breath. Stick around. Hey, fans, don't forget to get the seats you want to the games you want by purchasing one of our six game ticket packets today. Clean sheet of ice, period two is set to go. A tightly contested 20 minutes to start. Let's see if this continues here in the second. Well, Cheryl, over to the third of this one played. What do you make of this one? Toledo's got to find their way, James. I mean, right from puck drop, they just haven't had it. No sense of urgency, and as a result, they haven't been on the attack. The minority of shots, and really it's their goaltender that's kept them in this one. It's a tie game. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Puck scooped up by Santazzo. Gains the zone through center. Good check, frees the puck up. 
Moves it over to Cairns. Martin's crossed the line and is on the attack now. And that's deflected off someone in front. Baraldo's moving the puck through his own zone. The fuel have taken possession along the wall. And they keep the pressure on. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Malone's got it along the boards. And that's off target as it hits a body. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. Made the stop on the play. Scooped up along the wall by Tremonesis. Toledo's got the puck against the boards. Indy's got a hold of it against the wall. Quick feed to Martin. And he takes the pass. There's an injection of energy with that hit. Along the wing up the neutral zone. Goes right to the crease. Great save by Weeks. It always amazes me that goaltenders often make this save look easy with all of that traffic in front and screen. I mean, it is important to battle and find the sight lines. And this goaltender who does a great job of making it happen. Still plenty of time left in this frame. It's all tied up. Keenan's got it, and they'll go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Takes possession. Great reach with the poke check. Trying to gain a step. Stones him on the breakaway. Toledo's got the puck along the boards. Down the right side and into the zone. The Walleye have control of the puck. Indy's got control of it now from their own end. Lang's lugging the puck. Quick pass to Bomer. Here's the pass. Scores! Rips it off the pipe and into the net. Wow! He almost needed a double take there, James. When you hear that sound, sometimes you think it's out, but this one goes in. Well, this is a fantastic shot that beats the goaltender clean and hits the post. Doesn't come out, redirects right back in. That's a fortuitous bounce for the shooter. The Fuel have jumped in front by one here in the second. Uh, feels good, no question about it, to be ahead, James. Because when you're ahead, you feel like you can manipulate and you can dictate the game and the shape and the landscape of it. And they grab possession of the puck after that center ice face-off. Pass back to the point. Indy's got the puck in their own end. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Taken along the wall by Sancha. From his own end, he picks up the puck. And it's a quick pass to Sancha. Toledo's across the blue line. The Fuel have gained control of the puck in their own zone. Indy's looking to break out. With some open space at center. McDougal's going to play it against the half wall. The Walleye have the puck against the boards. Denobi's hauled down. Penalty on the way. Here comes the official's decision. Up by one, and you take the penalty, applying some pressure to the PK unit here as a power play as an opportunity to get the equalizer. Here's a first look at the power play. Well, a timely power play at this juncture of the game, James, to even it up. This is huge for this power play. Your big stars, they need to shine. Eric. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Nice play, shorthanded as they get control of the puck. On their heels, trying to clear. Slides it quickly to Pilo. And he takes the dish. Here's a shot. Turns it aside with the glove. Puck is frozen and will get a face-off. Lemos gets set for the face-off here as they will continue to play shorthanded. And they'll start with possession. Love saved me by Weeks. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Power play set to roll on as the setters get ready for the face-off. Lemos quick on the draw. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And he gets the job done. Big thumbs up clearing that one. 
Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. to get the equalizer in this game and they executed perfectly well this is an unlucky bounce james i mean when you're a goaltender you play your angles you know your set positions but you can't get set in a scramble like this and it winds up in the back of the net still lots of time left in the period the next goal could be a big one as we are tied tough break for the tender, James. I mean, listen, when structure breaks down and there's all kinds of stuff going on in front of you, you can't track, you can't get your eyes on the puck and it winds up in the back of your net. Toledo's rolling now, having taken a one-goal lead here in the second. Well, yeah, they got to be a wave of momentum that continues to push and press now, James, as they seem to have control of the game right now. They can't give any momentum back to their opponent. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. The pedal to the metal. The Walleye have put themselves in the driver's seat, now extending their lead to two in the second. Well, they're certainly deserving of their position in this game now, James. They got the go-ahead goal, and then they got that buffer goal. I mean, just to give them a little bit of wiggle room, they can take a breath, and now they can be a little more creative with the puck. The fuel. Toledo's got a hold of it along the wall. Through center along the wing. Indies gain the line and into the zone. Here's a shot and a great save. Bednar has been a consistent presence in the crease, James. I mean, he's made the stops he's needed to, but his team's playing extremely well, and that's why they have a comfortable lead. Cairns plays it along the wall. Takes the puck. Getting a little too physical to maintain possession. Takes the pass. Gains the zone from the right side. Indy's got control of the puck. Great defensive effort with the stick. Indy's going on the attack as they gain the zone. Centering pass! Great defensive heads-up play to pick it off. Sanchuk's got it along the wing. And now he moves it quickly to Donomi. Answered the call on that play. the puck. Good fight for the puck along the boards. At center ice now. He grabs the puck. Here's a short pass to Bolmer. Misses a golden opportunity there. There's so many moving parts in the game of hockey, which is why it's one of the most difficult sports in the world. And he gets to that prime time scoring area. You don't get that too often. And he just sails it. He misses the net. Saved by Weeks. Here's a pass down low. And he can't hang on after that hit. Picked up along the boards by Lang. There's the whistle. Let's get the call from the officials. The Walleye have to spend the next two minutes under man. unit is set. First opportunity on the power play in this game. And specialty teams are the difference so many times in a game. Huge for them to set the tone and really get the setup and the looks they're looking for. Oh, turns it aside once again. I'm not sure if anyone's helping him out there, but he's dialed in and doing it all himself, making consecutive saves. Another big 
face-off looming as this power play rolls on here tonight. Indies won the draw inside the offensive zone. Now let's see what they can do with it. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Gets it out of his own end. Toledo's got possession of the puck. Takes a shot. Wide. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. And the defenders come up with the puck. And they get the puck out of the danger zone. And not much on that one. Geraldo stick handling in his own zone. And they get that puck down the ice. And now it's grabbed by Baker. Both teams back to even strength as the power play comes up empty-handed on that one. Well, this power play unit will not be happy. Not only didn't they execute, but they had a difficult time making even crisp passes and attacking seams. they got to be better. trailing here late in the second period despite being the more active team offensively. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Receives the pass. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Takes a shot. Nice save from point blank range. What a fantastic save from a high danger scoring area, James. And I mean, he's bailing his team out. They have to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Shot! Oh, and he can't bury that one! Well, you don't get many opportunities like this in a game, James. You have to execute. He completely misses the net. Nice poke check. The walleye. How about now? And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. Here in the late goings of the period, Toledo's been the better club as they hold a 4-2 lead at this point. Indy's got it in the defensive zone. Moves the puck to Petroselli. Slip feed. Second period nearly into its final minute here. In front of the net, and the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. McCourt's carrying it ahead. Shot! Oh, save! Listen, Jane, the shooter's in the slot. This is as high danger as it can get, and he challenges. He's set, ready to go in great position and makes the save as a result. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Oh, he kind of struggled with that one, but it got just enough to keep it out. Moves it to Danone. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Quick feed down low. Here's a blast. Bigs, and he hangs on just as time runs out. And that brings the period to an end. All right, third period just around the corner. We'll get a clean sheet of ice. I'm going to get more popcorn, and we're coming back with much more next. The moment of truth has arrived for both these teams. Third period action set to go. And this one's underway here in the third. Well, with two periods played, pounder your thoughts. Toledo's ahead in this game, James, but for how long is the big question? I mean, the opponent just keeps storming back after a goal. This is a modern-day offensive game. No defense is being shown on this one. Slides the pass over to Martin. Good use of the body on the play. From the right side, they gain the zone. Now a quick pass to Limos. He carries the puck up along the wing. Prepovesis plays it now. And he slides it quickly to Pilon. Penalty coming up as the play is blown dead. The few have been penalized. They'll serve two in the box.
I love the one three one set on the power play unit they used earlier. Listen, they had success, they scored, but there's so many variations off of it. I love the bumper position that can act as a decoy, allow the puck to get through to create those seams and open up those shot attack lanes. They clear the zone. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Kanye's across the line now and on the attack in the offensive end. Played big in the moment there. Right up Main Street and on the attack. Here he is with the backhander. Great save from in tight. The goaltender is very aware of where that puck is in that low slot area and defends his crease by getting out, being aggressive, and taking away any of the net. Weeks freezes the puck and opts for the whistle. Chance to reset here on the draw on this man advantage. Santazzo's won the face off here in the offensive zone. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. Pass to Limos. Malone's almost ready to get back on the ice. And the PK unit gets their man out of the box. Although they're still trailing, this game is now within reach with that effective kill. That gives life to the entire bench. Pokes the puck away. On the attack along the boards. Sends it down low. The Walleye have gained control of the puck along the wall. McCourt's got it in the defensive end. Looking for space inside the D zone. The Fuel have the puck in the open ice. Cameron's taking it from his own end. Indy's got the puck against the half wall. Takes the feed. Directs it on over to Santazzo. Fires it on net. Oh, great reflex pad stopped by Weeks. The Walleye have gained possession off the wall. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Passes ahead from the right side. To the front! And he gets a piece of that one and denies it! Indy's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Bednar's got it, and I think there's a little strategy involved as he opts for the whistle. Well, yeah, I think he needs a rest, but it's also about game management. Listen, the only reason why they're winning this game is because he has been electric and dynamic between the pipes. Indy's won the draw, and they'll go to work. Oh, Trapper saved by Bednar. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. It's a two-goal lead here tonight. 4-2 is where we're sitting. Takes control of the puck. Steps across the line and on the attack down the right side. And that's knocked away by Gagne. Hunts the boards through the neutral zone. Hermogessis has it in the defensive end. Let's see what the officials are calling. The fuel have to kill off this penalty. Cross-checking is the call. Back to the face-off circle. They'll send the man advantage unit out again. Power play scored earlier tonight, and that gives you so much confidence heading into this one. You know how you executed the first time, but we'll be looking for those same openings. Hooked away in the defensive end. Moves it quickly over to Hatfield. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. Drives to the page. Tremendous stop by Weeks. The goaltender's at the last line of defense for a reason, and this time, he bails his team out. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Looking to set up offensively. Takes the shot, turns it aside with the save. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Hillis and company still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Off the faceoff, they take the puck. And the puck is cleared to a safer spot. Ten seconds left. Quick feed from a court. Takes it from the right side. And time expires on the power play. Both teams back to even. 
Already down in the game and your back's against the wall. This is a massive kill. You want to keep the game within reach. Steps into the offensive end. Quick pass to Hillis. And that's blocked. Scrum ensues along the boards. Moves the puck across to Denomi. Gaining momentum up along the side. Picked up along the wall by McCourt. Indy's looking to break out of their own end. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. Let's get the call here. The Walleye have put themselves down a man tripping the call. standing by with her answer to the head-to-head -head matchup tonight. Carl? Martin's been engaged and was able to jump in on the offense, guys. I've really liked his game tonight, so I'm going to give him the edge here. Good clearing attempt to breathe. Cameron's got the puck in his own zone. Here's a short pass to Martin. Oh, he got a little sliver of it, and it stays out. A player should never be left alone in the slot, but man, is the goaltender to task here. Gets out in front of it and makes the save. And Tassel's ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. Indy's won the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. The Walleye have gained possession under man. And the puck's knocked loose. The Fuel have possession along the boards. Scoring pass. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Oh, they do it again. And look at this. Oh, sorts of pressure here. themselves now making this a one goal hockey game yeah and it feels like it's going to be a race to the finish doesn't it james i mean they're right there they're all over the puck and real urgent here we go looks to pass it to keenan toledo's got a lead in this game predominantly because of that second line and the offensive production that they've had in this game there's a lot of motion they're playing what oh he saved it what a stop well, that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and sending a clear message to his team that he's behind him. He's going to be the foundation tonight. I really want to look at this last save again, James, because this is about taking it to the next level when you have this level of competitiveness, athleticism, and desperation and urgency in your game. You know that goaltending coach, they can't just teach this. This is instinctual, and this is what winners are made of. Indy's got it in the offensive zone. With the stop. Oh, what a save as he denies them again. Penalty coming up here. That's the third call of the period, and it really looks like they weren't dialed in or ready to play in this game, and preparation is key. Otherwise, things like this happen. They'll go right back to work here on the power play. What an opportunity having success earlier on the power play. They recognize where the openings have been. But what I love about it, off the post, and he puts it into his own net. Well, you don't see that very often when you
to shoot it into your own net trying to clear the puck? That's ugly. Indy's had more shots on goal, but yet they've run into a hot goalie. They trail late in this third period. Hillis wins the draw at center. Along the half wall with the puck. And it's a quick pass to Hadfield. Quick stop by Bednar. Well, these are the saves when you know that your goaltender is dialed in, James. The ability to get to the top of the crease and be square to the shooter, that's a great save. McGrath is a true sniper, James, and he's already got two in the game, and you know he's looking for his third. Quick shot. Oh, and he has the answer there with a fantastic stop. Well, this save was way more difficult than it looked, James. I mean, there's so much traffic in front that he's fighting through to see, and he finds the puck to make the save. Quick shot. Too many bodies in the way. Handles the puck. Here's a blast. Here's a shot. They've got the extra attacker out here for the faceoff. Well, they'll be looking for a quick win and advance that puck right to the net. And they win the draw in the offensive zone, and they go to work. And that's blocked in traffic. And he was right there to make the stop on that play. And he's pulled over to the ice and loses the puck. Slides the puck over. Puts it on net. Only just gets a piece of it to keep it out. We know the goaltender was set to this position, square to the shooter, to be able to make that club save. Officials have got both teams ready, and it looks like play is set to resume here. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Scores! And look at that, they answer right back. Well, the game is a hodgepodge of counters, and this is exactly what needed to happen. They were scored on, they respond quickly, and they find themselves in a favorable spot. Well, the goaltender makes their way to the bench, so the extra attacker is on, and it's all about urgency, being first to the puck, owning it, and look to attack at all costs. Indy's been leading in the shot department most of the night, but they continue to trail here late in the third. Possession after that neutral zone draw. Centering pass. And the scores. And there's the counter punch we were looking for. Cheryl as they answer back. Well, they answer back and they take the wing or the momentum out of their opponent's sails. This is exactly what they needed to get back on the board and get the momentum shift back in their favor. Well, he had his eyes on the puck. He tracked it perfectly and got himself set to position, James. I thought he had it. He got a good chunk of it, but he didn't get it all.